All right, everybody, here we have a human skin model, and there's a couple of receptors you should be able to point out. Um, the first one that we're going to talk about is this right here. It looks like an onion cut in half. This is your lamellar or Pacinian corpuscle, uh, deep, and it's used for deep pressure and touch. While up here we have our Meisner or tactile corpuscle, and this is more used for light touch and it's up in the papillae in the skin and again it's related to its function it's superficial because it's used for light touch all right now we're going to look at a histology slide of primate skin to see if we could find those two corpuscles again all right so i am going to go ahead and drift down on um, the first layer you see this is all stratum corneum part of the epidermal layer and then there's the rest of the epidermis right there and right below that, inside the papillae, or papilla for singular, is your Meisner tactile corpuscle that's going to be used for light touch and pressure. Alright, so once we have that superficial corpuscle out of the way, next we are going to go deep and try to find a lamellar, also known as Pacinian corpuscle, and this is more for a deep pressure. All right, these are really easy to find because they look like an onion cut in half. Here's one right here. So you can see the onion rings that are right there. But again, this is your lamellars, a.k.a. Pacinian corpuscle, and deep for deep pressure. All right, so this is a, another histology slide that we're going to look at. Um, this is a lamellar corpuscle that's been isolated. So it's this big circle right here beneath a lot of this tissue. And you can see how big the circle is, that corpuscle. And you can even see some of the rings of the corpuscle. 